In Chinese, there are two types of characters: traditional Chinese and simplified Chinese. To find out how these two types of Chinese characters are used in different countries, watch this video for more information. Christmas is coming, and many of you will be writing Christmas cards to friends and family. Wouldn't it be great if you could write "Merry Christmas" in Chinese? The greeting phrase "Merry Christmas" is written this. I know it may look a bit overwhelming for you, but don't worry. I will walk you through each character. And since our focus is on how to write the characters, in this lesson, I will only cover two writing rules in Chinese. The first character is Sheng. The radical of these characters is Tu, which means Earth in English. What is a radical? A radical helps a reader to discover the deeper meaning of each Chinese character. Each character has one radical. So our first writing rule is: always start your writing from top to bottom. Next, Dan. The radical is "yan," which means speech in English. Now, each time you see this radical. You know the characters you're reading is speech related. This character may look complicated, but it has only X strokes because it has a combination of falling and turning strokes. So, here's the second rule: always start your writing from left to right. The next character is Jie. The radical is Chao, meaning grass, and it has five strokes. Again. Writing from top to bottom. Kuai. The radical is xin, which means heart, and it has seven strokes. You write it from left to right. The last character is le. The radical is pie, which represents slash. This radical has no meaning, so now you know that not all radicals have meanings. Now you know how to write "Merry Christmas" in Chinese. Congratulations on completing this lesson. These are not easy characters for beginners, so I'm proud of you. And don't worry if you didn't follow the correct stroke order. For now, you should feel good about yourself. We will continue to learn how to write more Chinese characters over time. But now, please fill out our questionnaire and subscribe to our channel. Happy learning! Bye.